Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Bernice, and if you're new here, welcome. Hey sis, how are you? Congratulations on waking up this morning. If you already read the title, you did already read the title. Today we're going to be talking about personal hygiene products. Because I got tips, I got secrets, I got stuff I want to share with y'all. Okay, so we're just going to get really right into it. So these are... I just want to say this is not this this doesn't mean you have to do it i'm going to make this disclaimer it doesn't mean that you have to do it but these are things that i found to be most useful and like just beneficial all around um so let's get into the nitty-gritty of things so first and foremost razors let's talk about them okay the this is one of my favorite ones i like and highly recommend getting razors that have paddings around it to balance it off. This one is the Bic Soleil Balance. And it has, I'm going to show you guys. It has moisture bars lining it. And this just really just helps to protect against like having razor burn. Against possibly getting razor burns. And it makes it a smooth and slide glide. Like I... I'm a huge advocate for it <laughs> um i just really 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 love it because it just it's just so good it it gets it without causing you to have razor burns because we all know how it feels when you have razor burns like it stings putting on deodorant hurts um wind blowing it hurts everything hurts and it's just there's no need for you to have razor burns in 2020 so get your hands on these this is really it's not that badly priced um there's also the Gillette one, I believe. That was the other one that I used to. So anything, just any type of razor that has padding around it, I highly suggest. It helps to minimize razor burns and razor bumps. And while also like moisturizing things. So it's definitely just a great alternative, okay? So next in line is this, oh the Olay body wash let me tell y'all about how great this body wash is this body wash is astounding <laughs> it leaves you feeling like butter like it feels so good it moisturizes you don't need to use that many pumps like literally one pump will get your your towel your loofah whatever you use it will get enough soap on there to bathe you. Like, it's, it lasts a long time. You can keep this for, like, a whole month or so. Like, listen, we got this at the beginning of quarantine, and there's four of us, and it's lasted us all of quarantine. That's amazing, okay? That's, for four people? Yeah, okay. Talk to me nice. Because this, it has Ultra Moisture Shea Butter, um, Kiki Palmer, the way I found out about this specific one was through Kiki Palmer because she did an advertisement with them um, and she's like the spokesperson for this line with Olay and I was like, and I trust anything Kiki Palmer says, okay? I trust anything Mrs. Palmer says. Miss Palmer, if Lauren Kiana Palmer tells you it's good, trust me, it's more than likely good, okay? And she put me on and I was like, you know what? give it a try let's see what kiki's talking about okay because they got her out here doing this like black girl joy moisturized skin advertisement we don't get that often with dark skin black girls okay we don't get that with brown skin black girls we don't get that so for her to be able to do that and truly stand by it i knew it had to be good and sure enough it was good so i highly recommend that next in line i recommend nivea 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 if you have dry skin Nivea will save your life. This, the 72 hour one, and it has um deep nourishing serum and pro vitamin B5. Listen, this thing saved me all winter. <laughs> it saved me all of winter. Like Nivea, the brand in itself is just absolutely incredible. I live by it, I stand by it, and I just let me let me actually moisturize my hand now. Just just cuz, okay? Just cuz like it feels so good on your skin it's so smooth do y'all see the difference in how my hand looks now like wow 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 okay you know what look at that 
mask on, mask on, mask on, mask on. Like, that's what moisture, and it smells so good, and it goes with all your perfume. So, like, it's a very subtle scent. So, if you spray perfume, it's not going to mess it up and make you smell weird. Like, it, it works. It's just so good. It's just so good. Love it. All right, next in line, this is something that I stand by. I advocate for. I'm just a huge spokesperson for ladies. Ladies, ladies, ladies. Let's have a conversation. Toilet tissue is overrated. And we need to admit it. It's overrated. It's overrated. It's jaded. It's just not it. Okay? Wipes are where is that? I want you to understand and hear me clearly. Wipes. Girl, using wipes will change your life. Your life will get changed. You get unscented wipes instead of toilet paper because one, you just feel cleaner. It gets it. It is, oh, wipes are just that girl. It is that moment. It is everything, okay? Wipes just, oh my goodness. Honestly, get you some flushable wipes. This is a Cottonelle one. And if you, and it's hyperallergenic, it's hypo, not hyper, hypoallergenic. And there's 42 wipes that come here. Girl, girl, I'm a huge advocate for using wipes over toilet paper. Toilet paper, it gets caught up, it breaks up, it just, it's not it. And especially when it's that time of the, one, the month, using wipes is it literally is so perfect it wipes down everything it keep it makes you cleaner feel cleaner and is cleaner like it just sanitizes you better but without interrupting your ph balance balance too much so that's why i recommend getting ones that are unscented so your ph balance doesn't get thrown off too much but besides that i love wipes i stand by wipes and i just the wipes are just incredible honestly just just get wipes girl just don't even think twice about it. Next time you're you can get them in a the grocery store. You can get them at Walmart. You can get them at Target. You can get them at whatever. Like, girl, get you some wipes. Get wipes. Get flushable wipes. Because you don't want to mess up your plumbing. Okay? So flushable wipes. Not no baby wipes either. Don't be taking the wipes from the babies. The babies don't want their... They need their wipes too. Okay? If you can live a life of luxury, so should the children. But lastly, my last tip is hand washing your underwear. Hear me out, y'all. I know some of y'all gonna be like, what? I'm not doing that. Why would I do that if we have washing and dryers? Listen, it helps to preserve your underwear's lifespan. So you don't have to be buying underwear every month, every two months, every three months. Hand wash your underwear. And if you, if it really bothers you that much to hand wash your underwear, then I highly suggest getting uh, undergarment holders that you can put. Okay, so they're like undergarment holders. So you put all your underwear in it, within it, and it's like a closable bag some of like some of them is like a ziploc bag style some of them is like actually clicks and closes and you can put your underwear in there and then you put it in the washer like with the rest of your clothes when you wash or if you just wash your underwears by themselves but you keep it in that bag and it helps to protect it so that your underwear doesn't fade quickly that it doesn't um mess m m ruin your underwear lifespan so i highly suggest getting those and oh <laughs> I was wrong. That wasn't my last tip. My other tip is se having separate items for cleaning your body parts. Okay. Have a loofah. For my white girls out there, use a loofah. Because I, I already know my black girls do it. Black girls, Africans, f basically just foreigners. Loofahs are what we use. We live by and die by loofahs. Have a loofah and have a separate towel. Like a small washcloth towel. The loofah is to use for your body, and the washcloth towel is to clean other places. So you need it for two different things. Like, I hear people be like, oh, I don't, why do I need to have that when I can just use my wash towel? Like, 
no why are you no so the the towel that you're going to use to clean there you're going to use to clean your whole body like that doesn't make sense to me i just no don't do that don't do that wash your wash towels every two weeks clean like change out your wash towels every two weeks the same way you're supposed to wash your bed sheets every two weeks you need to wash it every two weeks and change it out so interchange your washcloths every two weeks and change out your loofahs every six months three to six months so every three to six months buy a new loafah because you it's just sanitary it's just that's just what you should do because it's sanitary and you don't want to do anything that can disrupt your ph value and you you don't want to do anything that can just leave you feeling unsanitary so those are my feminine hygiene tips um i do have more so if you guys want a part two i can go ahead and give you guys that um but let me know in the comments below what are your sanitary hygiene tips and uh yeah don't forget to comment to like and subscribe 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 i'll see you guys in my next video thank you so much for watching bye